Hi, I'm Doug Ailes with Wasco, and today I'm joined by Mark Schauer with the Burndy Tool Truck. Mark, what would you like to show us today? Well, I'd like to show you our brand new tool and product truck. This is a slide out showing all of our Pat Patriot uh, battery operated tools from cutters to 12 ton crimpers to 15 ton crimpers, products that these crimpers would be able to handle. In a tool like this, what range of connectors can it create? Our PAT uh, 81 KFT uh, LI number 8 to 1000 KC mil, so it's got a pretty wide, wide range. It's a four point tool in that it will come in at four points uh, 90 degrees, very similar to uh, a crimp like this. We've now pulled off from the truck another tool, a PAT 750 LI. Mark, what can you tell us about this tool? Uh, the tool has a range of number 8 to 750 uh, KC mil. It's a dyed tool in that you need a die, uh, the proper die, to, to crimp. It's got a 360 degree uh, head rotation for ease of being able to work uh, in a trench. Position our ignition trigger in the lower position for a safety factor. Mark, I also see the brand name on the battery. These are all of our tools are made in the U.S. So we're a U.S. manufacturer for versatility. Uh, the Makita battery, uh, 18 volt lithium ion. I've noticed these dies are very shiny. What material are you making your dies out of? Tool steel. Tool steel. Inside of your dies, you have an embossing system. Tell me about that. Uh, the embossing system is uh, put in place so that it is an inspectable uh, crimp. Uh, each die is marked and, and is certified with your particular uh, diameter. You can see that by this. You can see the uh, inspection marks on the, uh, on the barrel of the lug. Awesome. Our overhead tap, our underground splices, uh, this is our new transformer connector. Uh, it's adjustable. These uh, hinges swivel. Thank you, Mark, for a tour of the Burndy tool truck. Mark, if someone would like to know more about the Burndy products, where can they go? They can go to burndy.com or, of course, you can visit Wesco. Thank you. Thanks, Doug.